Hello ladies and gentlemen, Lizardboy here. And for today's video is actually a topic I actually wanted to talk about though. Because I've recently noticed a lot of people are doing complaints about a certain um, item that came out quite a bit ago. I think it was two years ago or a year ago that we finally got the, um, the Godzilla Criterion Collection though. Which to be honest, is, I know we all can agree that this is the best thing ever though. Because it's got all the original stuff, uh, background story of each of the movies though, and it's got a little um, history about why they create this though, and I wanted to focus on the problem that's been going on least recently though. Yes, I know I'm pretty late to this because I'm starting to notice too on mine though, and I was pretty um, disappointed and sad though about this though, is that if you go to the back, very back where all the DVDs are at, you can see that I only have the ones in the slots, certain slots, is that the adhesive stuff that's supposed to hold the DVDs right in here has um, failed, actually, though, which, that's not good. That can tear up the DVDs, and I was lucky enough to actually save my DVDs. Um, some of them do actually a little bit have the uh, adhesive around it though, but I got stuff to actually clean it up though. I know it's hard to see though, but I managed to save the DVDs just in case something does happen. Uh, and I know some of you guys are saying don't do this to your DVDs like I have right here, but I have nothing else to put these DVDs in though. Like where else am I supposed to put them at? I don't have any cases or anything like that. I'm trying to... Fix, I, is there a way to actually fix this problem though, myself though? That's what I'm trying to find out. I'm trying to get ways to get in contact with Criterion though, but I don't have, I don't know what their email is or if they have like a phone number to tell them about this problem though. And it's been recently going on with just the Godzilla one basically though, which, I mean, I'm absolutely in love with this though. I'm happy I got the movies and everything like that, but I don't want this to happen to all the DVDs because I want to keep this though for the rest of my life. But knowing that this problem's happening though, Criterion, if you're seeing this, please tell us what to do though. I want to, I want a way to actually fix it myself though, or I definitely don't want to buy a new one though because to be honest, they're a little bit pricey though nowadays. I know it's, I got this for a little bit more than like a hundred bucks yes that is true I literally got this a little more than a hundred bucks though for this thing right here and but I bought it a couple years ago though like two years ago or a year ago and the problem started like a couple of months ago which I know I'm pretty late like I said late about this though but I noticed that everyone else is starting to do their videos and saying about this problem too though but I don't want to get rid of this. I love this though. This thing is amazing though. And it's got all the great movies. Look fantastic though. Luckily none of the DVDs have none of the problems yet though. Have them been scratched or anything like that. I have some stuff that actually can take care of the DVDs. Like cleaning and stuff like that. But is there a way to fix this myself though? That's what I want to know. And if there's a way to contact Criterion though. Email. Phone number. I've been trying to go on their website though, and they have nothing though. Like, come on. But I don't want to have this problem with these DVDs right here though. I don't want to buy a new one though. I want to keep this for the rest of my life. I mean, if anyone else is having this problem, please let me know. I mean, I have Instagram. I'll put a link in the description below. Please do check that out. And please let me know if anyone else is having this problem though. Because I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one, and I've seen other people do it too. But, my DVDs are a bit safe right now. I just have to find a different route, different way to actually store these though, because I don't have anything else to put them in. And I know some of you guys are saying, don't do this right now, you're going to ruin them. It's the only option I have left. I am sorry. But, and like I said, this thing is great. It's got all the history about Godzilla, and why they created this stuff, uh, stuff like that. It's pretty cool, and I don't want to replace it though to get a new one. No, because I'm pretty sure it's going to happen the exact same thing if you get a new one. Pretty sure it is. 
So basically this topic is about the problems with the Godzilla Criterion and if there's actually a solution for this though. Please let me know. And it's been a different video though, but I just want to get this problem out though and let people know about this though. And I'm pretty sure other people are starting to notice it too though. But like I said, I love this. Please help me though. But thank you guys so much for watching this. I hope you guys enjoy it. I hope it's very helpful for everyone else around us who actually has this though. But thank you guys so much for watching this. Please check out my Instagram. Like I said, please check it out to let me know. But thank you guys for watching this. I'll see you guys and talk to you guys in the next video. Bye.